Good morning from Costa Rica. Sunday, January 21st. It's our 23rd day here in Costa Rica. Just want to do a little introduction to this video. In this video, you'll see the concrete pouring process. Um, it's been ongoing the last three weeks while we were here, have been here in Costa Rica. Uh, the first section of the video is when the Panama team is here. Um, the second section is um, just myself, as well as the gardeners that work here at the Oasis. And then the third section is myself, my nephew, William, as well as the gardeners at the Oasis. In all three sections of these videos, you'll see just the process, um, the forming, making the wooden form boards, bending rebar, and uh, pouring the concrete. So stick, uh, enjoy, stay through to the end to see which of the Barley Boys is most likely to be on the construction site on any given day. Uh, and as always, um, subscribe to our channel if you haven't subscribed. Uh, hit that like button and uh, leave a comment if you have any questions. Thanks. Time for another construction update. We got all the footer holes dug. See them down there. We're about ready to pour eight columns. It's the first mixing of concrete. Feels good. Um, I don't know if you can see the concrete mixer down there. So we're get right there. There's the concrete. And uh, yeah, should be fun. See the rebar in there. Uh, let's get that concrete mixer up and running. It was just even getting a concrete mixer uh, working here, it was crazy. So all the concrete mixers are electric and then they're 220. So this morning Ben had to run out and get uh, 10 gauge wire and then a new breaker for the panel and it had to be 26 meters long and such an ordeal many trips to the hardware store uh, we just got finished plumbing all the form boards and staking them to the ground and should be good stay tuned So that's mixed? Yeah, well. Day 12, <clears throat> start in the morning early. Gonna wire some concrete, uh, wire the concrete mixer. Red on the right, white on the left. And let's get this concrete mixing going. All wired up, let's get her put back together and see if the switch works. We cut the bags in half with the utility knife and then lift them with the rebar and then we put them in the machine. We're just riding the lightning here pouring concrete in Costa Rica. If it isn't one thing, it's another. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> but we're almost done with the first column. Really? Yeah. Oh man, you guys are... The Nicaraguans up the mixture of uh, 
concrete and gravel. Okay. So that's creating more, more uh, material with less material, if that makes oh, any yeah, sense. Oh, yeah, yeah, so, More so volume can, with less concrete. That's what they use and that's what they like? It's looking good. Okay, cool. mix. So we got one column poured and there's already a, a hiccup. We, um, the key from the motor to the pulley that turns the concrete stripped out. So we got to find a threaded screw to fix this and keep the machine working. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. Hey. Hey. Today's pour went well. We've got five columns poured. It's like 10 a.m. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. And then we're about to pour the last one right here. So, um, went very well, so stay tuned. Just pouring some concrete in Costa Rica. <laughs> Day 16 on the construction site, Williams arrived and his first job on the construction site is taking inventory of rebar. We're about to do some rebar, tying some rebar uh, for the last eight columns. Ben's in the background, starting with the form boards, down by the famous wood-fired pizza oven. And Brendan's just up here keeping it real. Okay, William, we got our first rebar cage constructed. High five. We are one eighth of the way done. Any comments? No, not at the moment. All right, let's do number two. You should be a pro after number two. I'll turn you loose. Oh, great. No pressure. Yeah. No pressure. Yeah. We'll, we'll have Oh, good. So you have to teach it to, to JL. Okay. Hi, camera. Day two for William's trip to Costa Rica. Hola. <laughs> we are assembling the form boards. You can see there's five, uh, one on the ground here, four behind me, and there's two up there. We're almost done. Yesterday, William and um, the Balky's daughter did a lot of the rebar bending. We've got, how many more do we have to do, William? Two. Two more. Yeah, I think we had six done yesterday. So the goal is to sort of place each of these form boards in the holes today and prep for concrete pouring tomorrow. We'll roll in some clips of the assembly process. He's, metal ladder. he's fabricating these metal ladders. He's come, you can see the cages behind, the rebar cages behind that he's fabricated. He's on his last two cages that will complete eight. Over here we have the form boards, which we're about to install. We've got eight form boards. 3 p.m. on day 16 here. William and I are dropping the form boards, the last eight form boards into the holes. And uh, we're anchoring those form boards. We're plumbing them. We're making sure they're level and coplanar and uh, anchoring them to the ground, getting ready to pour concrete first thing in the morning. Anything to say, William? Nope, not the moment. Number eight, number eight. Going up. Day 18 here in Costa Rica at the Oasis, Nueva Ferrez. And uh, our goal today was to start pouring concrete. We are a little bit ahead of schedule and the hired help that was gonna help us pour concrete today cannot make it. So we currently have all our form boards in place and uh, the rebar bent and installed in the form boards. And um, we might try to pour some concrete today. We will see, stay tuned, and uh, yeah, it's a quiet morning here at the Oasis. See the moving tools around. Ben hopes to uh, fire up the pizza oven um, at some point today, so maybe we'll have uh, wood-fired pizza this evening. Stay tuned.
It's go time! Here's the work crew today for the cement. Yep. We, four, four out of eight. Four out of eight done, and we're ahead of schedule by four columns. And you were planning on four today, right? So that was your goal? Oh, well, yeah, we're ahead of schedule, and our goal was to stay ahead of schedule. We got like four and a quarter, technically. We got that like little bit. I dumped one load and that one by accident, and then we dumped that little bit. So four and a quarter. What did you think of your first day of concrete? Very tired. Tired. You'll sleep good tonight. Yes, I need, I need bed rest. Okay, this is uh, Williams. Welcome to the Oasis Nuevo Ferrez Pizza Parlor. So, can I try it now? Yeah. Cheesy. It's good. Boy, say it's good. I love you. I like it. If you're giving me some advance, I would have prepared some poetry, but it's amazing. One of the be better pizzas I've ever had. Let's go. This way? That's correct. Okay, truck full of gravel just arrived. Uno. Uno. Dos. Tres. And we're done with the footers. There's the mixer. Jose and Kalor just turned it on. Let's get some. Uh, thanks for tuning in to this video, and I hope you liked it. Uh, in summary, just to wrap up the first three weeks of construction, uh, progress went a little slower than I thought, but I just uh, was excited to get the uh, foundation poured. Next week is our last week here in Costa Rica, and our goal is to start welding and uh, framing up the structure with welding. So stay tuned for videos on welding and putting the structure up. And uh, as always, thanks for keeping us in your prayers and thoughts and uh, following along and liking and subscribing. Have a good day.